Hello everyone and welcome to Game of Thrones, episode 5 of Nest of Vipers. No long story short, um, I lost my safe off from um, 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 mall swapping. So yeah, really pissed because they actually released it early, 6 o'clock, but I was having trouble downloading it. Not anyone else was having trouble, just me mostly. But I finally got to begin. Yes. Now, I will change my choices if they lead to death or something. I'm worried about um, Mira mostly. So Previously I on Game of Thrones. Pray, pray Mira. Oh my gosh. You'd help the second sons. Guide them into Marine. I can't, Asha. This could be our only chance. Get them into the city. Help them liberate Marine. And I will see that you are rewarded. Okay, so I'm gonna call it. That's good. No! I'm... Uh... I'm a friend! Okay, good. My choice sticks. I was gonna change the fan, but... Um, yeah, I wanted to change the fan, but... No, oh, whatever. Don't move! To be honest, I really don't trust Finn anymore. Oh, we got Bandage! That's good. He looks ugly, though. This... Is my sister. Is my sister. Sylvie. Sylvie. I love her eyes. I have to get in there, sir. Please don't threaten it. Lord Whitehill yes. is up to something. Fuck yes. He's conspiring against my, my family. And someone this is good in there I'm is happy. I'm okay. Andros is hiring cell swords. Please Hundreds of them. What? He's building an army for Lord Whitehill, big enough I watched to trailer, march by the way. against Iron Man. I'm sorry I didn't do a because I'm currently moving. I want you to keep but an I'm eye fine. on everyone. I actually want to change my choice to don't get to bring him because I'll, I don't want anything happening to I'll him. Do my best. Sorry if I'm interrupting, but I had to. Come on. Rodri! I'm told you're a man who can't be broken. I've decided to come see for myself. And no lag this time. Okay, maybe a little bit. <laughs> Oh my gosh, we're, we're I was just telling you, anywhere. sister. Father's been oh looking gosh. to make a just match wait, for me. So and Talia's been such good party. company. Think she likes me? Or maybe your mother? Her flower plucked is still a flower. Just dies more quickly. Really we could be a family, Lord Forrester. You'd like that, wouldn't you? You killed Ethan. Your mother may need some convincing. You killed our brother! I've killed many brothers, sisters too, but let's put our happy day to the side for a moment. We're gonna go outside. Walk with uh, me. Uh, oh, <laughs> you won't need your sword. Not where we're going. You can't die. Oh, fuck it. I'm not going without my sword. I'm afraid you are. Here, I'll help you. He can't die. He obviously can't die, so this is a privilege that I hate. There! <sighs> Doesn't that feel better? Oh, you're coming oh. too. This is Lord's business, not a child's. I say she comes. I don't trust her with my men. Well, you did fight Griff, <laughs> to be honest. Oh my gosh, a huge airplane. And the window's open, yes, because it's hot as hell in here. Where are we going? Oh yeah, outside. Oh my gosh, they look so cute together. How fares your father, Lord Bolton? Better than yours. <laughs> Tell you, he didn't grab a knife. Polite of you to ask. He should grab the knife, but then again, she was she's a kid, so she probably doesn't know. I loved playing in the woods when I was your age. <laughs> Still do. So many places to hide. I've gotten very good at finding people. Oh Roderick? It's all right, I have a feeling that Ramsey that reminds is going to me. Play, um, Griff? In episode one when he did that guy. I expected I to be Gary's greeted by him on my arrival. Bit of a disappointment to have to show myself in. And here I had such high hopes uh, for Ludson. Griff and his men are under guard. They have no place Why here. They, tell them? they do if I say they, they do. Oh, I really hope things might be different with you. 
I hoped we could be friends. After all, I was generous. I've allowed you to keep half your forest. Your livelihood. Really? Yet you went behind my back and called in the Actually, glen. Actually, it was Lady, um... Oh my gosh. I'm not sure how you managed that. The Glenmores have sworn their loyalty to they my father. Guess. Lady Elena Glenmore is our guest. The soldiers accompanied her to ensure her safety. If her safety is a concern, perhaps she should not have come to Iron. Where does she go? Well, um, she, she I'm certainly glad there. we've sorted this Maybe out. Thank you for being so forthcoming. Listen, stab me. But there's still a price. Ah. Here we are. Arthur! Run, Rick! You disobeyed me. Oh, please. 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 No one has to pay. Let's just Wait, keep talking. Bit. I'm bored of talking. <laughs> no! <laughs> Stop! <laughs> Look at what you've done. I hope it was What's worth it. Like Is it worth it, Arthur? Please stop! <laughs> please! Please! Talia, don't look away. No! It's very important you see what comes of disobedience. <laughs> Make him stop! Please She'll do her. something! Don't look! Please. Look at him, Talia. I, I, I did bring him. Oh my gosh. Why must he do this? See what your brother's done. Please! Please! Lord Ramsey! Like Sorry. Him. He was my favorite. But Epicure. they'll never learn otherwise. <laughs> mercy, have mercy! Mercy, my lord! Did Roderick show mercy to Griff? This is his fault. I will admit I did hit four times. That's a lot of blood. <laughs> Please stop. Please stop, Lord Ramsey. <laughs> no. Is this nipple like cut off or something? Oh my gosh. All lads fell. Not dead. Let's give him a minute. <laughs> you want to kill me, don't you? Release him. I have to do it. Go on. Prove how strong you are. Do it for Ethan. No, Roderick. He's toying with you. He doesn't Do it. die. Come on, Roderick. Kill me. I knew it doesn't die. I'm impressed. Woo. Lucky for me, you're a cripple. I may have misjudged you, Roderick. I came here to kill you. But now, I'm thinking it might be far more entertaining to watch you and Lud tear each other to pieces. I never die. want to come back to this fucking shit stain of a hold fast. I have better things to do than to play wet nurse to you and Lud. So you'll settle this on your own. Last house standing wins. Otherwise I'll kill you both and be done with it. Actually, house no. Forester will win this the way fight. Is. You're very confident for a man with no army and half a face. And one more thing. <laughs> Can't leave a job half finished. <sighs> Ready the horse? I wonder if you were with Lady. Not sure you'll have much luck finding other Lady allies. Lady Elena in there instead of Arthur. I wonder what happens if I fought Arthur um, Clemson. Oh, 
I did learn about it. I did bring it. And um, maybe it would have done the Sentinel that was left behind. That could have been it. That's why I wanted to change my choice to um, Duncan instead of bringing up so royal because I was worried that they might have done something. I'm pretty sure that's all so soldiers. That's a lot of blood, I bet you'll say that. Innocent blood shed on forester lands. What would father think? Only a monster would do such a thing. The Boltons will pay for this. His name is Quiver too. No, I miss Quiver. Or Arthur, whatever. Martha. Did he. Was he holding? Oh, I'm so sorry. I miss him. I keep asking myself what we've done to deserve so such hate. Alive. Did we bring it on ourselves? Okay. Oh, wait, I did bring Duncan. Or is this house just cursed? This is my fault. If I hadn't agreed to Elena's plan. You didn't do this, my lord. Blame Ramsay. Blame Lud. Blame the guards if you have to. But don't blame yourself. Mm. The Glenmore guard are gone. Ordered home by Ramsay. Oh, so... So much for having Wait, allies. Wait, did we them, or did we not? This is so confusing. Ramsay says go. he's not taking sides anymore. He means to let the strongest house survive. I intend that to be us, Duncan. We have... But can we even fight them? No. We don't have the we numbers. We don't yet have Ryan back. And if Mira's right about an army from yeah. the south... Right now, everything depends on Asher. Mira. Mostly Mira. Once he and Malcolm bring us more fighting men, then Where is we... he? Where is my brother? My lady. My lady. Holy shit, she must be... Oh my gosh. She must be so... Let me through! Elena. Roderick, tell me where he. Oh, no. No. Oh, no. No, Arthur, no. Arthur. It's my fault. I brought him into this. Well, to be honest, it was your fault. I asked him to help. He did this for me. I'm so sorry, Elena. I know how much he meant to you. He meant everything, Roderick. He was my little brother. I'm going to my choice. He has to survive a few bartends. I was there the day he learned to hold a bow. Game of Thrones. He was um, so nervous. The father called him Quiver. And now to die like this. It is Game of Thrones after all. Mutilated. He died bravely. He died as he lived. Bravely. As a man of the North. He died in agony and for nothing. Mm -hmm. Look at him, Roderick. There's hardly anything left oh, of him. Yeah, his stomach is same. So gone. Elena. I'm sorry. I like Elena's face. It's amazing. That's not weird. Oh, 
Let's get you someplace warm. How do I do this, Roderick? How do I keep well, going? You must Where do I find the strength? Pain fades in time. Never fully. But enough. I don't want it to fade. I don't want to forget him. You won't. How could you? You've been such a friend to me, Roderick. Right from the very beginning. I should try to get some sleep. Romantic music. I'm not sure I'll be able to. But I don't know what else to do. You're not alone, Lena. I'm here for you, whatever you need. Thank you, Roderick. Yeah. Lena went through my body. This looks so romantic, even though sad at the same time. Mila? Come on, Mila. Oh my gosh, this is a safe bitch. Mia Forrester, King's Landing. Ah, oh, there you are. I haven't seen you since the coronation feast. How many ships do you suppose it takes to move an army? Ships? Why in the world would you... Never mind. <laughs> How many ships? Oh Mira. God, the I'll be honest. I took an enormous risk. Defying Marjorie to get you into that feast. And you thanked me by making a scene with Lord Andros. In front of everybody. I'm sorry. Marjorie saw, of course. And she knew exactly how you got there. Lord Andros is a threat to my family. He's plotting against them even as we speak. I believe you, but... You called attention to yourself, Mira. And you angered oh, Marjorie. Which is why it's not safe for me to be around you anymore. Like you, what? Mira, you're not the girl I knew at Highgarden. She'd never be so reckless. Please. And now, with Garibald refusing to talk to me, I just can't risk being associated with him. you. Not anymore. Marjorie is my only protection without him. I need you. Sarah, you can't mean this. I have too few friends in King's Landing oh, as it is. Tom. I'm sorry. I really am. But I I wonder just if I can't anymore. Oh my gosh, what if I if I Was it worth it, at least? Sacrificing so much for your family. Nothing worth losing you. Nothing's worth losing your friendship over, Sarah. I would have said the same thing once. Oh my gosh, Sarah hates me. I'm so angry. And she said to help. Oh, God. They'll be very grateful. I better go before she sees me. She already You're a thinks. forester. Oh, God. Can I help you? You need to come with me. Now. Why would I? Don't make this difficult. You can't kill me, people. We're in public. Oh my gosh, Marjorie like hates me. She wants to like. Uh... Back to Asher and Fesca. I Asha thought we'd be happy. I'm glad he's dead. Felt good plunging the knife in at least. But it doesn't feel like I expected. Oh yeah. I thought I'd like feel lighter. Something. Is that your way of saying thank you? I, I guess I'd like to get. Um, kill the maester, which Ooh, I wanted. We should I'm never glad that most of my choices was I city. wanted, so I'm pretty happy. It only holds pain for me, Asha. I was hoping to bury it all with Dezor's corpse. I can't imagine what it must have been like. Please, I don't want to talk about it again. Asha, you're Yay, back! Yay, Malcolm! Okay, good, you got first. <laughs> Uncle! I want Bashka to do. not get Let's collect our second sons and get out of here. You did as you were told. Daenerys should oh deliver. God. Daenerys, huh? First names with the Queen now, are we? Okay, we did everything I'm pretty sure. Oh, I'm not sure. Daenerys, she's not going. Your Grace. 
My nephew has returned from his mission. It seems you played your part in the taking of Marine, Asher Forrester. Mm -hmm. Did you run into any trouble? Uh, uh, Reports from the battle are muddled. Perhaps you can clear them up. Well, my time is short. Nothing out the ordinary, uh, Your Grace. You fulfilled your orders. All of them? Craft probably told her. I heard rumors of an incident in the city. Do you know anything about it? <laughs> what does it matter? We completed the mission as promised. Yeah. Surely that's what's important. Obeying your queen is what's yeah, important. That. I thought you told me your nephew is a man of honor. But he cannot even take responsibility for his actions. Your Grace. You killed the master de Zorzoraza when I told you his judgment belonged to the slaves of Marine. And now you come to me for a reward. Why should I let this pass? Yes, it would. Why would I? Don't you dare. What do you have to say for yourself? Don't. I'm waiting. Because Besco was de Zor's slave. For years. Damn you. She deserved her revenge as much as any slave in Marine. You have my sympathy. <gasps> Keep your pity, Dragon Queen. Give us soldiers and we'll be gone. I apologize for her, Your Grace. It's all right, Malcolm. I do not hold it against her or you. You have proved yourselves in battle. And while you disobeyed my orders, you had yes. good reason. Oh my gosh. Unfortunately, I cannot spare my second son. What? But your grace, the mission was a success. I need every soldier to hold Marine. What did I tell you? She was never going to help us. You promised me Croft and his second sons. Which is why I'm not going to let you leave here empty-handed. I cannot give you my cell swords, but I will give you the next best thing. Money or something? Gold. Is I'm good? This gold will be of use. Perhaps you can find the swords you need in Marine. Thank you, Your Grace. We promise to put it to good use. I'm sure you will. A new day is born in Marine. The slaves have thrown off their collars. There are fighters among those who used to be bound. On behalf of the Foresters and the Branfields, I thank you. Oh yeah, where's the mel um the See that you are ready when I, I return forgot, to Westeros. Um, to be honest, I actually forgot. Sad but true. I have other plans for you, Malcolm. What? Plans for me, Your Grace? Your help, I suppose. Plans that will help House Forrester, I hope. I would like you to stay and serve what? me. What? I have a task for you. Your Grace, I... I am humbled. But I owe my allegiance to my family. And they will be grateful for the Targaryen alliance you've helped forge. I am honored you would ask me. Might I discuss it with my nephew first? Do so. But let me know your answer soon. Will you get uh, owe me if we do like him? You know, like him, I'll... You'd seriously consider staying in Essos? I'm not sure. This is all rather sudden. If she does come to Westeros, we'd want Daenerys Targaryen on our side. You've made a good start with her. I could strengthen that bond. You're right. You're right, Uncle. The Mother of Dragons would make a powerful yes, ally. If she succeeds in taking the Iron Throne, she'll be the only ally we need. But whatever comes of this, we still need men who will fight for us now. The Queen thought we might find them here, among the newly freed. Don't even think about it. You just couldn't keep your fucking mouth shut, could you? Had to tell her everything. You sold me out for a chest of gold. <laughs> Eska, I'm so Don't fucking say it! It seemed like the best defense we had. The scum had it coming. Make sure Wayne never gave us gold. Now he's dead. And we still need soldiers. <sighs> Little Queen is right. Marine holds plenty of killers. And I know the worst. So what are we waiting for? Let's go get them. I don't know, Asher. They're not like us. To them, killing is a sport. It's fun. Yeah. Let them have fun with the White Hills, then. 
As long as they kill them, I don't care. Like, don't say I didn't warn you. We still got soldiers and they have none. I must talk further with the Queen. <laughs> don't get yourselves killed. Okay. So, where exactly are we going? Well, these fighters used to be slaves. If I had to guess, I'd say they'll be trying to live like masters. Oh yeah, we have gear it. <laughs> I knew it. Oh my gosh. I feel like everything's calm for now. Well, except Bardrick, of course. Well, it, he was calm for a second. Give it title, Northern Forest. I'm glad I told Sarah's secret because she's a bitch of leaving me. You never know, she could come back, so that could be something good. Maybe she advances inside instead of outside. It's getting worse, isn't it? Where's the White Walkers? But we're only about a few days out from the Antler River. We cross the bridge the first men built. And from there, we can try to find the North Grove. I don't know what the North right, is. Sylvie? We're not going North. We're going South to join Mance and the rest of the Free Folk. But look... That was always the plan, Cotter. I have to go to the North Grove. My family's depending on it. <laughs> Your family needs you to wander around in the snow until you get eaten by a direwolf. Hey, like Please, that. Sylvie. He knows what he's doing. Does he now? Tell me then. How did my brother get that gash in his arm? Uh. You dressed his wound up well enough. But why did he get hurt in the first place? Ooh. What does that have to do with the- Hush, Cotter! I'm asking Fishface asking here. Why? Sylvie! Don't Sylvie me! I want to hear it from him. It was at Castle Black. It happened when we escaped Castle Black. There were men chasing us and- That wound's fresh as can be. Are all crows liars or just him? Point is, you don't belong Jeez. out here. Sylvie, I've known Gadded a while now. He may not be one of us, but I trust him. I've been waiting months for you, Cotter. And when you finally come home, it's with some crow who can barely build a fire. No, we don't need to die for him. Well, we've made it this far, haven't we? Getting here was the easy part. I like how she's filled with lots of snow. The further north you go, the more likely you'll never come back. It's just not worth it. Once Cotter's fit to travel, we head south. With or without you, Garrod. Sylvie. You need to rest. And we'll be wanting something to eat. That's true, we need food. I won't go far. Oh, don't be angry, Garrod. I'm not. This isn't what it looks like. I can explain. Why'd you even bring me here, Cotter? You said you'd take me to the North Grove. Sylvie knows these woods better than I do. If anyone can find the North Grove, it's her. And besides, I couldn't just leave her. I won't do that. Not again. Then convince her to go with us. She's your sister. Well, maybe she's right. Maybe you don't belong up here. You don't mean that. So that's it. I can't head north without a guide. I go where she goes. I'm sorry, Garrett. <laughs> Am I stalking her now? Don't tell me, White Walkers. Could you have been any louder? Sorry. Oh wait, that was me. Never met a crow before. Wait, did it... Sorry, I almost killed you. Oh wait. Might have done you a favor though. Plenty of things want to kill a crow up north. Hmm. Giants, fens. 
Shadow cats and ice spiders. And the White Walkers, of course. A spear sounds nice after all that, doesn't it? I'm not a crow anymore. I left that life behind me. Once a crow, always a crow. Yeah. That's what they say, I anyway. I to go, so, yeah. And there's the Don't find our dinner away. Shit. Take my bow. <laughs> I was never any good with a bow. Know how to use that? You're not going to shoot me in the leg, are you? I never miss. Oh my gosh, why did I say that? Yeah. Oh my gosh, I missed. I never miss. <laughs> I like you made it laugh. Okay, I know how to do that. You have to hold it. Ah, <gasps> oh, you're joking. Maybe next time, Garrett. Oh. Well, since we don't have any food... I couldn't move my mouse. It was, like, stuck. Like... I What's this? It was like hitting the keyboard. Your dinner. It won't fill you up, but it'll make you think you're not hungry for a while. At least I don't have to worry about you trying to shoot me. What if I shot an accident? You ever lost anyone, Garrett? My family. Someone you really cared about. Someone you thought you couldn't live without well, seeing ever again. Bad. Do you know what that's like? I lost everything. I my old life, it, my house. All I ever wanted was to fight for the foresters. This house? It was important to you? Oh, yeah. They treated me like one of their own. Cotter and I, we lost everything too. And we nearly lost each other. I didn't think he'd make it back this time. And I won't risk losing him again. Not even for the North Grove. Oh my gosh, you know something about it, don't you? Only what I've heard. But don't get your hopes up. It's not worth it. Please, I need to know. Please, Sylvie. I need to know. A few years back, one of the Ice River clan set out to find it. They'd heard stories, that the cold couldn't touch it, that it's safe even in the dark of winter. That sounds scary. So they'd set out, all full of hope, and none of them ever returned. That won't happen to us, Sylvie. I was sent to find the North Grove. That doesn't mean that you'll- Help! Okay, I'm gonna end that here. Hope you have been watching, like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next part. Bye!